Hello again, friends. Matt with Eddie's Guitars coming to you, as always, from St. Louis, Missouri. I hope your weekend's getting off to a positive start. We've got a guitar that uh, would certainly get my weekend off to a very positive start. This is a very special guitar we've got to show you folks today. This is from my good friend Tom Bedell. Very nice gentleman. He makes very, very nice guitars as well. This is his Revere Orchestra model. This is certainly among the top end of uh, his guitars that he offers out of uh, Bend, Oregon there, here in the United States. He really does some great work on his uh, kind of upper end guitars here. The Revere series, again, is the top tier of what he offers. They're typically Brazilian rosewood guitars and it's all old school Brazilian. Cool, cool stuff. He gets his hands on some uh, responsibly acquired great wood. So uh, we, we really like that and appreciate that. He started out here with a great looking aged Adirondack top. This has got a relatively medium width grain to this top, but it sure has a great looking uh, nitrocellulose aging toner on the top of the guitar, giving it a nice warm, a uh, little bit richer yellow color there. Uh, you can see the body, the neck, and the headstock of this guitar are all bound in a great looking, kind of a, a plain grain koa. It certainly is not a figured koa. It's got a little bit more of a plain uh, grain to it, which is pretty nice, popping really nicely. We've got a great looking abalone border going around the top of the guitar, and we've got abalone uh, on the rosette going right around the sound hole on this guitar. The back and sides here are uh, a three-piece set of Brazilian rosewood and this particular set is a little bit lighter in color. Uh, you know that uh, we've seen Brazilian come in a wide range of colors, grain patterns, um, grain thicknesses, I mean all, all kinds of variants. This is a very pretty set here though, got a little bit darker strip going right down the center there, looks great, and uh, kind of outlined in koa all the way down. We've got an inch and 11 sixteenths nut width down here at the nut, so relatively slimmer on the neck. This is a, a bit slimmer neck all the way around. It's, it's not a terribly deep neck on the rear end of it, uh, so it's a pretty manageable neck. Uh, we've got uh, black ebony buttons on wa nickel Waverly keys down here and a nice looking uh, ebony head cap overlay uh, going over the headstock there. Sure looks good. And we've got Bedell's three-piece block inlays. This is a, a fantastic uh, you know, example of inlay work here. Really quite unique. The shapes and colors that are working there are pretty extraordinary and, and just a very bold inlay package across the fingerboard on, on, a, on a very, very dark ebony fingerboard there. Sure looks nice. They build these guitars very, very light. It's got very light Adirondack braces. The top on this guitar is very, very thin, so they are extremely responsive. They use particularly stiff Adirondack, not only on the top, but also on the braces of this guitar. So it ought to sound very good, ought to have a ton of nuance to it. Well, let's go take a listen to it. The Bedell Revere Orchestra model really has a great and very, very mature voice to it. Like I said, it's it's made with really aged and light woods, and you can tell that it's uh, it, it really lacks any initial tightness that you have to break in. 
Uh, the thing really sounds great from day one. This thing's had practically no play on it whatsoever. It's a brand spanking new guitar, and it's already got just a ton of woodiness and nuance to it, um, and, and really great dimension as well, and it's just as absolutely as responsive as you could ever hope for a guitar to be. Uh, do check this guitar out in person if you have the opportunity here in our shop in St. Louis. They do not build a lot of these Revere models because there just is not the material for it. So if you have the opportunity to check it out, I would definitely recommend it. If you can't, though, do check it out on our website, eddiesguitars.com. And as always, do subscribe to our YouTube channel here. We'll see you guys next time around.